Okay, today is Thursday, June 6th. Right? The 6th? I think, I think it's so. the 6th. Um, we're still <laughs> losing track of the day. So out in the garden this morning, we've got our tomatoes that are planted. Um, and this is our first year where we actually started tomato seeds indoors ourselves. Um, so it was a bit of an experiment and some grew better than others. But now that they're out here in the garden, we're gonna see what they're gonna do. Um, and yeah, the hay just is a great, great mulch. Helps keep that moisture in, keeps the weeds down. Um, and then I am in a couple weeks here as they start to grow bigger, I will actually be tying them um, kind of a kind of a trellis style to the poles that we have around here. The other project that we had this morning was getting our irrigation system down. Um, and this was this was really interesting because oh Ryan and I were doing this and uh, we started yesterday adding to the irrigation that we had from last year. Um, dividing it up into five different sections in our garden because um, I can come down here and turn around. We had to, um, so we got the main path down the garden here. <clears throat> okay, so I will turn around here. Hi, Rihanna. <laughs> All right, so here in our garden, we want to divide it up into five different segments to water one at a time um, to kind of boost water pressure and we didn't have all the same size hose and our local hardware store <laughs> we basically bought out all the fittings that they had and we ended up with kind of a cobbled together thing but we got it Bran and I um, applied our logic and lack of engineering skills to get this all fixed together. Um, and so here's what we've got now. We've got actually our, our 16 foot beds. Um, and this is actually, this is actually going fairly decent. We uh, had some troubleshooting, trying to figure out just what was going on, like why we were not having good water pressure, especially since each segment is limited to like five or six different beds. We turned out, figured out, even after I asked the kids to turn the hose on all the way, it wasn't turned on all the way. That makes a huge difference. Um, another thing that we need to be changing in the future because we had a limited supply of um, hoses and fittings um, and the valves, we have a half inch valve, but we have um, a three quarter inch pipe coming into a half inch pipe for the half inch valve and back to the three quarters just because um, that's what the pieces we had to work with. We only had the half inch valve um, and that also cut down on our water pressure some. So we're planning on um, changing that up just a little bit and instead of doing three quarter inch hose here, we're gonna switch that to half inch hose. But we had fun, right? Yeah. You had lots of fun? Yes. I called Rana my muscles because it was her muscle strength. She's stronger than me, you guys. Um, her muscle strength that got all of the uh, connectors pushed in in place. But girl power for the win. All right, so yeah. You want to sing anything, Rana? Thank you, God, just about everything. So now we can water our garden. Here's our other makeshift thing. We had additional um, fencing for our other older trellises, but this one um, is wire on the top and paracord on the bottom for the peas to climb up. So it works. We start with what we have, even when it's not perfect, and we make it work. And every year we grow and improve on what we learned the previous year. And that's what it's about. It's not about doing things perfectly from the beginning. It's about doing our best with what we have. 